Hi guys and welcome back to our autumn day in the life. This video is actually in a collaboration with Kayla from O2 Abone. I'll have her channel linked down below so be sure to go check that out as well as a bunch of other mamas sharing with you what their autumn kind of day in the life looks like for them and their family. But yeah, I hope you guys do enjoy today's video and as always don't forget to give it a thumbs up and let's get into it. Right now we're actually outside, as you can tell. <laughs> we are finding nature treasures. We're gonna do a bunch of nature crafts today. I know in the fall time we love doing fall crafts, so we are out here trying to find some little fall treasures in hopes to make some really fun crafts. But yeah, we're gonna take you along with us as we do that and just go about our day. What did you find? Did you get moss? Wow. I wanna add this to the treasure. Add it to your treasure bucket. That's going to be awesome. Yep, <laughs> that is amazing. I got off of this tree. See? Can you show me where the moss is? This is where the moss is. Wow. What's it feel like? Pretty soft. Is it nice and soft? Yeah. You know what? The moss this. is beautiful, isn't it? Hey, look. I got a big piece. Ooh. I like it. Can I get a picture? Sure. Ladybug on your sleeve. <laughs> it's so cute. Oh, say hi, ladybug. Yeah. Ooh, those are pretty. Look, I got him off. He flew off. He flew off. Yep, he's right here. Where's your point? Ooh. See him? There he is. <laughs> yep, there he is. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Look at your bucket, Al. Awesome. Very cool. Looks like we might be getting some rain. Let's see, ooh, this is a pretty one. I got some bark. Ooh, can I see it? Yep. Ooh, that's cool. I like it. Put it in my shoe. All right. I got bark in mine. You got, got bark? Tree. <laughs> Is that fun? How strong are trees, Mom? Very strong. What's this? It will only. <laughs> They're pretty strong, right? Exactly. Yep. Hopefully that one doesn't knock down. Yeah. Yeah, it's bent a little bit, so we're gonna have to cut that one down. Yeah, I agree. Okay, it's getting chilly, so I'm gonna take a little miss inside. You wanna go inside? We have a few green tomatoes left on our plants. So we'll see if they turn red. I don't know if you guys have ever had fried green tomatoes, but fried green tomatoes is something that like we grew up with when we were small, so I may end up picking some of these and making some type of like a fried green tomato thing for dinner tonight. The kids have actually never had fried green tomatoes, so might be a good time to try them since we do have quite a few. I'm gonna build <laughs> hair. I'm gonna build an eye. I'm gonna build a bridge. We are gonna build some little nature sun catchers. Do you remember how in the summer we took this sticky contact paper and we put the little flowers on them and made little sun catchers? And then we have our two big buckets of nature treasures that we found just now. Right? So all we need, yeah, so all we're doing is we're gonna do autumn sun catchers. Mommy will go grab our little autumn leaves that I pressed in a book to dry out. So we have this, and then this, our sticks Mommy? for the frame, and then we'll be ready to go.
in the middle of making dinner right now, and right now actually the kids are hiding. So <laughs> me and a little miss here are gonna go find your brother and sister. Can you go find them? <laughs> we love playing hide and go seek, it's really fun. It's almost like a daily activity, especially in the evening. There she is, hi. <laughs> All right, now we have to go find Oliver. Where do you think Oliver went? You guys under my bed. I'll check on Oliver's bed. Okay, good deal. He's not under there. Where do you think he is? Maybe under mom's bed. Sometimes he can be really sneaky. He's really good at hiding. We'll sneak out of the house. <laughs> Ooh, wow. Very cool. So where I keep it? Not forever, though. Not forever? No. Well, we should probably go ahead and put it in a little jar of dirt. Yeah. Since that's where, okay, home, so that's where the me... worm belongs. Okay. So let's get a, a little I, jar uh, and fill it up I with dirt. Wanted... Yes, you were well, right. Well, the brick, that ain't with all the bricks, and there's not much dirt down there. Yeah. Well, let's get a little dar uh, jar of dirt. Oh, uh, let's not put them on the table. Let's put them on the plate. Go ahead and put your little worm in the jar. And then let's go fill it up with dirt, right? First, now me and you. These are leaves. Yep, these are a snack. Oh, that's the worm snack. Yeah. Awesome. We're wormsy leaves, so they're super easy. Yeah. All you have to do is put uh -huh. these. So if they ran out, just put some more leaves. Well, that's awesome. So, Ellie, yeah. so mommy, when the leaves are out, uh -huh. it's time to put them back. Okay. Maybe on a winter day, we'll put them back. Yes, absolutely. Because you can keep them. Yeah. Just not forever. Not forever. Okay. <laughs> so the boys are outside cleaning up the yard, so it's just me and Ellie. Can you say hi? Hi. <laughs> we're learning how to draw caterpillars. So we're watching a little YouTube video. Should we do one more circle? Any other circle? Awesome. Did you make a nice little home for your worm? Well guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it even though it was very short and just a small glimpse into what our Sunday afternoons look like, especially in the fall. We do a lot of like outdoor nature collecting, a lot of nature crafts, and as you saw, a ton, a ton of reading. This is honestly kind of what our living room looks like all through the fall. Thank you guys for being here again and I will see you in the next video. Bye.